Yes, it's me, Lucid. Hi, I'm back from the dead, but not really because I'm pretty sure my last video was when I was pulling for Clubware Leona. I can't actually remember when that was, but I like to say it was sometime um, this year. But yeah, it's been a while, but hi, we're back. And yeah, I mean, it's a tradition at this point, and I've said this before, but four years, four years in a row, this being the fourth year. But yeah, we are here because, you know, the greatest celebration of all time of the year. This is like the big event, right, for this channel. That's right. It is Leona's birthday. Now, there is something that I do want to make note of. Not that anyone cares, but, you know, I just want to I just want to talk about it. Uh, I usually record these on the 27th of July itself just because, you know, it's more special that way. And I just like doing things like that. But this year, unfortunately, I am recording it a day earlier on the 26th just because tomorrow I have a, a bit of renovations at home and I'm gonna get all my curtains changed. Yes, every single curtain in my house changed. So, um, yeah, it did not occur to me when the um, curtain person was like, yeah, you know, we're gonna come down the 27th of July. It did not occur to me until like a couple of days ago. I was like, wait a minute. Um, the 27th is Leona's birthday, uh, but they're coming down to like change my curtains and that's gonna take like the whole day because I gotta, you know, assemble everything, but, um, yeah, so I was like, okay, uh, you know what, there's no choice, I'm gonna have to record this a day early, and here we are. So, yes, I'm sorry for the little bit of tangent <laughs> at the start, but... That's not what we're here for. We're here today to celebrate. Even if it's a day early, we're here to celebrate our king's birthday. That's right. We have an amazing card. As always, as usual, it's Leona. He slays every time. But yeah, without further ado, let us get right into the pools. Let's go. First Ten pool now unfortunately if you guys have noticed i do not have any more spare 10 keys or just like spare single pools just that's because i used them all up um the last chapter of the sum sum was really they, they really just took all my keys because i wanted to get all of the sum sum dorm leaders and then i think there was leona's club wear so yeah i unfortunately used up my reserve um, spare keys, so we're actually gonna have to use uh, the magic crystals for the first time in a while But yeah, it is what it is. I mean we are gonna get a free tan pool tomorrow But yeah, that's fine because hopefully this year we will get Fingers crossed fingers crossed, but I saw a post on it's either Tumblr or Twitter, one of those two, but uh, someone actually pointed out that Leona is actually the only dorm leader that has not gotten an SSR card for Halloween yet. So, yeah, because of that, I mean, fingers crossed, we all know that the dorm leaders get, like, special treatment, right? That's just, you know, one of the perks of being a Leona stan, but... Uh, yeah, fingers crossed that this year, Leona actually gets a Halloween SSR card. And, um, yeah. Again, I don't know what the event is gonna be. Uh, it's, you know, it's not gonna be a continuation of Playful Land or Glorious Masquerade. Like, we are past those. Uh, and, you know, just following the trend of how Aniplex has gone along, you know, with their Halloween events. But regardless, uh, yeah, I mean, it'll be great because, you know, I mean, not only are we getting an SSR card for Leona, like, it's gonna be great, but also it means that the Halloween event is going to be, um, it's gonna play a big role in it, is what I'm saying. So we're gonna get a lot of screen time for Leona. I feel like he doesn't really show up in a lot of events. Uh, he does make, you know, cameos, like, here and there. Like, for example, right now, we have the rerun of port fest jack and he does you know he does have a few scenes here and there but you know i mean it's as a leona stan you know i would love an event that is like centered around him and whoever the other ssr cards are as well uh, not only that um 
because of the trend of Halloween events that we've gotten, uh, they're trying to um, include the villains from other Disney movies that did not make it as main characters in Twisted Wonderland itself. So, you know, we got Rolo and uh, last last year, and then last year we got Fellow and uh, Gideon from Pinocchio. Uh, Rolo, of course, being from the Hunchback of Notre Dame. So, you know, we can sort of try and guess, you know, what new villain are they going to, I guess, twistify this year, you know, have a twist version of. And um, one of the villains that I'm actually really, really excited to see is actually Shere Khan from The Jungle Book. Just because, I mean, he's a tiger. And I don't know, I feel like if he's sort of like the the big bad, you know, or like quote unquote the villains, they're all villains here, right? But if he's sort of the um, the main villain for uh, Halloween, then, uh, I feel like, I mean, he would have a good rivalry with Leona, you know what I mean? Like, that, that would just be entertaining. But again, that's just me, and there are still a couple more villains that I'm probably not thinking of. Well, off the top of my head, well, Shere Khan is one of them, and um, Captain Hook is another one. Maybe Mother Gothel? I would love to see that. Uh, but again, you know, there are definitely still a lot more villains. It's just that, you know, personally, I do hope uh, if we get, like, a Shere Khan twist version, uh, with an event where Leona is the SSR card. That would be like some really good dynamics, you know, some really great scenes. But yeah, that's um, that's just my theory. A twist theory, if you will. Uh, or a speculation, a hope. I mean, listen, right, as long as Leona is the SSR, I'm not really complaining. But... Yeah, I mean, feel free to comment down below who, you know, what's your speculation for the Halloween event because we know that's going to be the huge event of the year. I'm really, really interested to see, you know, what uh, theories other people may have or like what um, observations or things that you have picked up just from playing the game, you know. Really, really excited to see that. Also, we are on the JP version right now, but on the EN server, which I, I may pull after this. I don't know if Fiona's banner is on yet, uh, but on the EN version of Twist, uh, if you guys play that, uh, the Cloud Calling event, or basically Leona's hometown event, is actually ongoing right now. And yeah, that's really, really cool. Um, they actually localized it as Cloud Calling Festival, which is actually a really cool name. Uh, you know me, I, I'm not really a fan of a lot of the localization that they did for Twisted Wonderland. Again, that's just me. But, you know what, Cloud Calling, it's, it's one of those things. It's not just because, you know, I'm biased towards Yuna, but I genuinely think that Cloud Calling is a really cool name for the event itself. Like, that just sounds so cool. Uh, but, yeah, Leona's um, Cloud Calling, or Lion Garb, no that's what they call it, Lion Garb, no um, costume is uh, running right now on the EN version. And then, of course, we're gonna get his um, Bloom Cap or Bloom Birthday banner as well this year. Uh, I will check it out after this. I don't think I'll make a video on it just because, I mean, we already have uh, the video that I did last year. And yeah, I don't really have anything new to add to that. Um, Oh. Hello, Ruggie. Okay, I was like, uh... Yeah, well, I mean, it was an SR, it wasn't an SSR. Yes, I am still paying attention to the cards, don't get me wrong. I am just, you know, putting in my commentary over this. I hope I'm not rambling on too much, because honestly, I am... I kind of don't want to edit too much, but you know what? We're here. It is what it is. Like, I'm gonna try not to, like, cut out as much as possible just to make my editing life easier. But yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, we haven't been getting that much luck in the pools. I say that, but like, you know, 
Uh, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. At the end of the day, right? As long as we can get the owner's card, I am satisfied. I am happy. That is all I ask for. And uh, yeah, we already knew the poses, or at least the splash art for the. Oh. Okay. Nanda, sono shinpai sou na me wa. Ore datte bijutsukan ne wa hin yoku wakimaete sugosu. Okay. <laughs> well, um, thank you for interrupting me again for like the one millionth time on this channel. Oh man, Leona, I was I was gonna say, I was gonna say, ah. Uh, I mean, look at that pose. We, we already knew, well, what the poses, what the splash art this year would be just because it was sort of revealed. Uh, this is a collaboration with the Disney 100 and uh, they had like the artwork for all the characters already. And it was sort of a pattern that, you know, a lot of people noticed, including me, that, oh, hey, you know, their birthday splash arts this year, because it is for the Disney 100 platinum jacket, it's gonna be the same pose as like that official artwork that they posed like a long long time ago so yeah i mean it's a great artwork regardless like just look at leona look at how sassy he is and obviously the portraits uh behind in the splash art also have a connection to the characters especially for the dorm leaders i mean look at scar right there like yes yes and then the hyenas as well Listen, I am, I am here for it. Okay. Leme no kuni kokris bijutsukan no supporter ni nimmei sareru to wa koujin no itari. Kichou na shuzou hin wo tannon sasete itadakou. Sir, excuse me. You're not allowed to do that. Hello, but like, but like, oh my gosh, guys, guys. Look at how he fills in the jacket oh all right look at those body proportions even though he's not really oh my gosh that's right like for a very like one of the rare times right where the owner is actually covered up <laughs> right like i mean am i wrong because like usually you know he's always showing a little bit of skin a little bit of the man titties right in his in his cards am i wrong like this is this is a very rare time. I think the only other time was um, in his very first birthday card. But even then, you know, this one he's fully covered up. I mean, I'm not saying that's a bad thing because he still looks amazing, right? And I mean, like I said, he's filling up that suit, okay? So, all right. Anyways, hello. Hi. Again, that took me off guard. Um... Oh, you know what? He said here, have another one of me. I know you can't get enough of me, so here. Okay, well, I think this was the 70th. Yeah, somewhere in the 70s. Uh, I don't- okay, there we go. Yeah, 70, there we go. Um, at least I didn't have to go to pity, so, you know, that's- that's great. Um, with that being said, <laughs> no, 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 that's not the end of the video yet. Uh, okay, well, I mean, we're done with the pools. And let me just see. Yeah, let's go and check out the new card. Now, unfortunately, I cannot invite uh, the new card to the dorm because I already invited someone else. So, yeah, it is what it is. Uh, but yeah, there we go. Here it is. Ta-da! Look at him! Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Uh, now that I am, I have a better look at it. Oh, you can definitely see his teeth. Oh gosh. Leona, 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 my sleepy... Forever sleepy lion. Listen, right? I mean, if there's one wish that I want for Leona, and I'll ask it every year, I just want him to be happy and healthy. I mean, that that's literally what I wish for myself and, you know, my close friends and family as well. Like, hey, listen, health and happiness, most important. Money too, money too. But, hey, Leona's rich. He He's not really short on money on that front, okay? All right. Uh, can I... I can. Okay, um, give me a while. Let me just... 
Yeah, okay, so they also hold the the Disney wand. <laughs> I just realized that because again, like I haven't pulled for any of the other platinum jacket characters. I think I have used my friend's assist cards. But like it always slips my mind until I actually see it itself. Uh yeah, they actually hold like the little Mickey Mouse wand um when they attack. So yeah, I don't know why, but them like holding the wand, it's it's giving me like Disney Channel vibes. You know like those memes of uh, it's not the memes, but you know how those like Disney child stars like Hannah Montana, um Selena Gomez, you know them, and then they will they will be like, um, this is Disney Channel, right? And then they'll take the wand and they will draw on like the little Mickey Mouse face. You, do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, it feels like they will do that. And you know, I can definitely see them doing it because this is a Disney property. Alright, we are back. I have viewed and by viewing, I mean I've skipped the three vignettes just because I don't want to spoil myself on the groovy splash art. But we're back and I'm gonna groovy my lion man but yeah. okay i'm super excited for this i mean i have seen the groovies for the other characters as well i mean and a lot of them usually give this a very like devious look to them and especially for the dorm leaders like they are staring at sort of the the portraits because okay the context here is they are in um the museum i don't know the official name but it's like they're in this like disney museum with all the portraits of the different disney characters and usually especially for the dorm leaders right uh, they are like staring at a portrait of the the protagonist from their story my guess is we're gonna see leona sort of grinning deviously at a portrait of simba or mufasa in that case or both i don't know Anyways, let's let's see what it is. I, I'm very very excited. Nawari ni amaya kasare te sodatta lion no ko. Sazo kashi rippa na o ni natta nda. My god oh my fucking god leona leona come it out he he looks like oh my gosh like feral like, you know those fanfics because <laughs> like i feel like leona is sort of like people see him or like at least savannah plays like feral their beastman feral oh my god this this now listen listen i know i said that that like that the characters would be sort of grinning deviously at like a portrait of their rivals or like a disney character um i was not prepared for this like i genuinely feel attacked like he's gonna come out and fucking kill me uh, he looks actually my okay like no like actually <laughs> actually evil like i feel like in this portrait the overblown Leona took over for a second there. And like he snapped, he's unhinged. Um, he's ready to create, sorry, he's ready to commit mass homicide? Not Patrick, no. Yeah, he's ready to kill. He's ready to start a rebellion and um, kill. And you know what? Like genuinely, like this, this, this face is something that I have seen. Um, it very it reminds me of Malleus, I believe, in his um was it like the ceremonial rope outfit? Like I feel like I've seen Malleus make this exact face or a very similar face. Like I've never seen Leona make this face before. I like, genuinely evil. He's not actually evil, don't get me wrong, but like Like he hates them. <laughs> he he hates Simba. And yeah, so I was right. So this is like Simba and Nala and um Kiara with Rafiki. But yeah, oh damn, like, he's ready to murder. You know what? <sighs> Listen, I know I said I wouldn't condone Leona if he does something wrong. I might just let him do it. <laughs> like, if, like, if he told me, Listen, I want to kill someone <laughs> to become king, you know what? I might just let him do it. I might just let him do it. Sir, I was not prepared for this. 
I think that's, you know what? I just made a realization here. I think that's like the most emotion that I have ever seen Leona with. Because he's usually like very chill, right? He doesn't say much, he doesn't do much. He's just chill, he's just there. And even in his other cards, like he does look smug or, you know. Here, like genuine, like I can actually feel the genuine emotion from that. He hates them. <laughs> He hates them! Side note, I think I forgot to mention this, but his duo magic partner is Floyd. Yeah, which I don't know why another thing that I realized for Leona, they always uh, pair Leona up with either Floyd or Ace. It's always these two for some reason. But um, yeah, I'm gonna have to like look at his vignette after this just to see what he says. Like, what is the context for this? Wow. <laughs> Wow, I mean this, this, this is, mm. okay, this has awakened something in me, no, no, uh, we're not, we're not gonna simp, do not simp too much, do not simp too much, Lucid, you cannot simp too much, ah, oh, I fear it's too late, okay, I gotta stop staring, oh, <laughs> I stare too long, my phone screen went black, I, I apologize for that, that was probably like a jump scare, like, oh, why is it all black now? Alright. Yeah, I really can't stop staring at it. Like, damn. Damn. Okay. Alright. That's it. Gosh, I, I love both of the splash arts. I love both of the splash arts. Like, okay, do I want sleepy, chill, soft, baddie Leona in the, in the basic splash art? Or do I want, like, unhinged, feral, murderous Leona in the groovy, like, you know, pick your poison. Which one do you want? Okay. Fanfic writers, do your job. There you go. Here's the material. Like, you could write a hundred page fanfic just because of this one picture. I know I could. あの、秋翔の古い土に美術館ね。この美術館はよっぽど警備員の腕っぷしに自信があるんだな。Did I never buy these? I know I bought this cuz it's at 19. I'm guessing usually it's at 20, right? I feel like I've never bought any of these. Was that a new edition this year? I think so. Okay, I'm need to buy all of these and then um, yeah, this one is Scar, so, you know, just a little, just a little remembrance, a little homage to, you know, the OG himself. Okay, uh, that's the event shop. It costs gems, so I'm a bit hesitant. Oh, fuck it, we... We'll do it, we'll do it. We have to do it for Leona. We have to do it for Leona. I can get back 300 gems. It's okay, I just have to grind a bit. Oh, wait a minute, I think I found it. Okay, wait, I found it, I found it. So it's a... It's a guest room present? Oh, okay, I think I know, right. The little present is, uh, well, a present that you can give to Leona. So it's basically meant to help level up the guest room level. Alright, since we're in the guest room, let me just try and just give it a try. Here we go. Okay. Yeah, okay, so this is specifically for Leo. Oh, wow. Okay, that just straight up levels you. Like 10 levels. That That's actually really, really good. Yeah, that's really good. Okay. Um. Wow. And then I get three of those. So, uh, I think, let me see. I can, I can use those presents on any Leona card. I want to guess. Uh, the rest of them are all at, at least the SSR cards are all at level 10. But, you know, just for science. Yeah, okay. That, that works too. Alright. 
Teta. Jack cameo as well. I do have the Leona Porter. Up, uh, Jack! Jack, what are you doing? Oh, why did, why did you have to steal the spotlight from Leona? Oh, I know he didn't mean it. Jack is a good boy. Okay, but... With all those shenanigans aside... Um... That's pretty much gonna be the end of this video because I do not want to do that much editing. I'm lazy like that, I'm sorry. Can't even speak. Just, uh, Leona! Uh, Leona, please! Why do you keep hiding today? Oh... Uh, Alright. With that being said, before Leona hides himself again, I have him in a nice position over here. Uh, that is going to be it for this video. And I hope, you know... I'm wishing you all the best for all of you who are going to be pulling for his Platinum Jacket Birthday card, for his uh, Broom Bouquet card, or his Cloud Calling card on the EN version. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys again next year for the 5th anniversary. Goodbye!